this is a really beautiful 1948 Singer portable sewing machine model 221-1. They call this the featherweight um, sewing machine. This thing is in gorgeous, unmolested, all original condition. Um, it has all of these uh, original Singer sewing attachments. I mean, this thing is just very well taken care of. I wanted to take a video of this just, just to show you um, the fantastic original. This is all original. It has not been modified, oiled. I mean, this thing came out of a home. An elderly woman, um, as you can see, she took really good care of this sewing machine. Again, this is all original. Really, really nice condition. Um, this thing is really pretty. And for, for 1948, I mean, gosh, look at the condition of this. Um, it's, it's, it works. Um, we have not tested it with uh, cloth or, or sewing. Um, actually, we did. We, we ran, this has an old piece of, it looks like linen, that came with it. Um, we ran this through and it, and it went through the motions of sewing. Um, we didn't thread it or anything to try to test it, but uh, this thing just powered right up. And I'm going to demonstrate that to you. Um, just wanted to go over the, you know, the condition of it. I mean, it's got the original case. You have two uh, original keys. I mean, this thing, it even has the original Singer uh, screwdriver. I mean, this must be used somewhere for the machine, but um, it, it has uh, the Singer... Um, S M A N C of Singer Manufacturing Company USA, the original screwdriver. It has all these sewing attachments. Um, those of you who are familiar with these machines will know what each and every attachment is. Um, again, has the, this old piece of linen cloth that came with it. Uh, four bobbins. Um, it has a light under here. You know, we tried it. You know, I, I believe this is the light switch. We Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It works. Okay. You just witnessed something, folks, that I <laughs> I tried to get this bulb to work. And you saw it for yourself. Look at that. Look at the ray of light. I see the light. This light bulb works. I tried to get this to go. We thought it was burnt out. But surprise, surprise. So let me just shut this off. Oh, look at that. It illum Oh my God. Wow. Wow. This thing just keeps surprising me every day. Okay, so the light bulb works. I was going to say it's burnt out, but guess what? It's not. Um, nice foot rest. I mean, this, it, it looks like it's Bakelite. Um, you know, it's all uh, got the original tag on there. I mean, this thing is just beautiful. Original owner's manual. Uh, you know, I think that was her name up there. Oh gosh, this woman took really good care of this. We want to say it is 1948 because um, this book is, you know, copyrighted. Um, the last copyright, well, I'm going through this thing. Um, the last copyright on this book is 1947. So could be a 47 we think it's a 48 just judging by the style and uh it, and I, I think that's the woman's address there oh my god beautiful that the light bulb work I, I still can't believe that bulb works oh my gosh that's incredible well i'm gonna shut the bulb off because i don't i don't want to uh you know burn it out i mean it's it must be an original bulb but i'm going to actually no i'm gonna turn it on because i want you to see uh i'm gonna operate this it has the original um power cord you know the cord is great it's not brittle you know it's it's still very pliable this is your foot rest you know this goes on the ground you know and I'm going to press this with my finger but I'm going to zoom the camera in here so you can see the operation of this machine beautiful nice and quiet I mean oh my god this thing is really really pretty beautiful beautiful machine oh my gosh gorgeous uh oh we also wanted to tell you it has an original singer uh belt there um 
Now I'm going to turn this couple of things. Just wanted to let you know. Oh, the case. Um, so the case has the keys. The case has somewhere on the handle. As you can see, I mean, God, this thing for 1948. I mean, really? Really, we're going to look at the condition of the case. Um, very nice inside. It has some, you know, some wear. It even has the original. See that down there? It looks like the original cardboard, like, you know, plate that this the sewing cushion that the sewing machine rests on. It has the top tray. Um, I'm going to just move these things out of the way. Oh, it before I move the okay. So this it has these buttonhole templates. And they all seem to be there. I mean, this 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 woman really took great care of this machine. So I'm gonna push that back in. Uh, get a kick out of that screwdriver. I can't believe the light works. Oh my God, that's great. So now I'm gonna just unplug this for a minute because I don't want to damage this machine in any way. Ah. Oh, it's even you know, Singer. Everything's original. Um, it's a great original shape. The only thing that we... Oh, underneath here, here's where the under... Let me turn this into the light. I'm going to show you the whole machine. Under here is the, you know, the bobbin underneath. Um, that, I guess, feeds through the bottom of the machine. Here's the other side. I mean, beautiful Art Deco. Oh, my God. <sighs> Incredible. Um, nice Singer motor. There's the other side of the machine. You know, when this is ready to travel, that lifts up, and then you lower that, and it's a nice little tray. Motor is in great shape. As you can see, when you heard it, it was nice and quiet. It even has the original felt cushion, you know, for your spool of thread to, to go on. Now, underneath, I want to be really gentle with this machine. Underneath, um, you know, probably from storage, going to be really underneath. There is some flaking. There is some flaking of the paint on the bottom base. You know, this probably would need to just to be repainted or you can leave it as is. I did not unscrew that. We are not going to screw with this machine. We're just going to leave it as is. Um, but I'm sure this can be painted. See, a little, little piece come off there. But really doesn't make that much of a difference to the aesthetic appearance of this gorgeous machine. Um, I love the gold. You know, the gold uh, trim on this, the beautiful paintwork. Uh, Singer Manufacturing Company. I mean, this thing just is amazing, amazing for 1948. I mean, oh my God. There's an original sticker here. Someone must have serviced it. We're going to leave that on. We are not going to mess with this machine. Um, this will go to one lucky owner. I know these, these machines are highly desirable, even more desirable in this gorgeous condition. Uh, 